We want to take a few minutes to look at a problem and a solution. That problem, home builders say it takes longer to build a house and costs more money because there aren't enough people trained to work in the skilled trades force. 41 Action News reporter Charlie Keegan shows us how a competition for high schoolers today was part of that solution. Andrew Teeter comes to life when he uses his hands. Anything with woodworking, anything that's hands-on, I enjoy. And he's pretty talented. The Liberty High School senior carved intricate waves into the doors of this entertainment center. So I put both of them together when I was doing it so that it's a continuous flow. The piece is part of a competition the KC Home Builders Association hosted. It's all to expose high schoolers like Teeter to work in the trades. What's your favorite tool that you used? Jeff Huff, owner of KC Furnishing Company, hosted and and help judge the competition. There are several pieces that definitely I would have in my own home. I may be doing a little recruiting later. Projects like this desk Adrian built, well, they lay the foundation for students to get involved with home building. Next. There's a lot of really good opportunities for some, some kids who want to work pretty hard, uh, learn some skills. Drake Vidrine's job with the KC Home Builders Association is to connect high schools to people like Huff and construction companies so students can find a good job and bite into the current labor shortage. They'll have a job the rest of their life and it's satisfying. You can take a pile of sticks and end up with a house or you can end up with furniture. I'm real happy with how it turned out. So as Teeter appreciates his final piece, he can also appreciate the skills he learned along the way, which set him up for immediate success. In Kansas City, Charlie Keegan, 41 Action News. Thank you, Charlie. We had those home building experts at today's event help us put together a rebound rundown for anyone considering a skilled trade. Their advice, seek companies with a reputation for training their new employees. Also embrace technology. Many trades rely on software, not just hammer and nails anymore. And look for scholarships and apprenticeship opt apprenticeships opportunities with unions. They say good people skills make you more hireable.